I ended up in Chengdu, capital of the Sichuan province. It's a story of two years' riding experiences in western China. Try to reach an area known as Kashmir. Altogether, the trip totals 8,300 kilometers or 5,200 miles in one month on a 150. Off to the distance over there, where you see When all the packing's done, it's time to head out into the mountains of western Sichuan. Outside the cities, Tibetan nomads still live as they did hundreds of years ago, raising and grazing the yaks which provide much of their daily necessities, such as the tent they live in and the food they eat. They ran a little over 500 kilometers, almost all of which was above 4,000 meters. Uh, several, several passes and a few hours of rain. Situated in the Terran Basin, this is the Taklamakan Desert. At over 500 kilometers long, the trans taklamakan Desert Road is the longest desert crossing road in the world and makes for one unforgettable ride. The breathtaking landscape of the Karakoram Highway doesn't disappoint. And just when I was thinking it couldn't get any better, Muztag Mountain appears over the horizon. Sitting on the bike, the cold, fast water was up to my chest. We pulled the filter cap off the engine case, and an immediate gush of water followed by a silvery clayish goo came shooting out the bottom. He starts shouting and looks over my way and accuses the cop and owner of acting special. The cop was reaching for the driver's shirt and punching him in the face. It was not on any map and a road I was advised not to take. At that moment, I should have known I had no idea what was ahead. But nonetheless, I think they wanted me to succeed. All right, now we are in the Jiaohe ancient city. It's uh, only about 1600 years old. It goes back to about 500 AD. Underneath its dunes are many buried ancient kingdoms and cultures who thrived here thousands of years ago before overgrazing and climate change turned much of what was once fertile land into this great beast of sand. Way over these sand dunes, probably about uh, 12 to 15 kilometers. It used to be an ancient culture, it used to be very large, it was called the Nia. And now, basically, it's nothing but sand. After crossing the desert, we head towards Hotan or Hotian in Chinese. Like most cities in Xinjiang, the architecture displays a strong sense of its Islamic influence. Today, it remains one of the most traditional and authentic Uyghur cities. Here we are at the Hotan Sunday Market. Looks pretty crazy. clothes that you could ever imagine.
going insane. Construction vehicles were blown off the road and onto their sides. The awesome power of the storm didn't hit me until I looked up and saw a violent stream of sand. At that very moment, I left my old understanding of the planet behind. It all came together now. Part of every tragedy is pain. I was informed they were going to jab a huge needle into my neck and then down into my shoulder. As he took me and Cannonball to the hospital, I knew my ride was over. No matter how hard you try or want something to happen, it may not turn out the way you want and you may have to do it all over again. But this is a difficult decision and you need to find a balance, you know, uh, between what it is that you're really trying to do.